Hey ladies, it's Christina coming to you from my bathroom. I have been getting a lot of messages lately um, from customers asking me what products Unique has to offer to fill in our eyebrows. And so really quick, I wanted to make a quick video just to show you the two products that we have. Um, obviously, Unique has our Moonstruck Precision Pencils, and this color is proper, which is the dark brown. So we have that to fill your eyebrows. We also have our pigments which are 100% natural mineral pigments and I'll be honest with you before starting with unique I was a hundred percent pencil I loved you know the exactness the precision that a pencil could give me but now that I've learned about these mineral pigments I am totally a pigment girl when it comes to filling my eyebrows so I wanted to demo this really quick for you to see yeah. our pigments are loose powder I don't know if you can see that here. So you're going to tap a little bit in the lid, just like you see, it's loose. I apply my pigment dry. You can apply it wet however you like it. Um, when it comes to picking a color for your eyebrows, I really decided that it is 100% up to your preference because I watched numerous videos on this and looked at all these different tips and I've just decided that there's no one who's really right because I've seen natural blondes with dark eyebrows. I've seen natural blondes with light eyebrows. I've seen brunettes with naturally light eyebrows. I've seen brunettes with dark eyebrows. So really it comes down to what you like and what you think looks good and your preference. So I like to use infatuated. So I'm using our infatuated um, pigment on my eyebrows and you need to use our awesome, I don't know if you can see this here. This is our liner shader brush. This right here is amazing on eyebrows. So all I do is swirl my brush around in my loose pigments and I'm just going to try and do the shape of my eyebrow. I'm gonna try and look in the mirror while doing this because I don't wanna mess this up. I start at the bottom and I'm just going to line the shape of my eyebrow. Now, my eyebrows, as you can see, are a little bit lighter. They're a little bit sparse. I have tried numerous times to grow these back and to go get them waxed and to do my shape over and I've just given up. It's not possible. These are my eyebrows and I just need to accept them. So when you're trying to do the shape of your eyebrow, you want to take your brush, line it to the corner of your eye and that's about the length that you should make your eyebrow. My eyebrows naturally aren't exactly that long so I'm going to try and extend it a little bit. I'm going to take a little bit more pigment on my brush now after lining it and I'm just going to fill in. Like I said, I have some empty spots. I have some places where apparently hair won't grow no matter what I try in my eyebrow, which doesn't make sense to me, but I have learned to accept it and use these products to my benefit. So I'm just gonna fill in, make it full, and pull it all the way through, okay? Awesome. Now what I like to do is I like to take our Amazing Lash Comb Brow Brush and just brush the pigment through. One of the reasons I am now in love with this pigment look instead is I actually feel that it is a softer, more natural look than the pencil. Um, obviously, again, it's by preference, but I just feel like it blends in better and it doesn't look as harsh as the pencil, and that's the look that I like. So you can kind of see the difference from one to the other. We'll do the other one really quick. Swirl it around, tap off the excess. And again, I'm gonna start at the bottom and I'm just going to use that liner shader brush end and lightly draw what I want my eyebrow to look like. And again, I'm gonna measure, I need to add a little bit of extension here. Line that out. Okay, I'm going to a little bit more before I fill in. And right here, seriously, drives me nuts. Like the worst part. Nice, little completed look. Um, but, you know, obviously it's up to your preference. It's just something that I love. Thanks for watching.